Hi, I'm Diane Austin, and I'm the CEO and co-founder of Coils to Locks. So today I'd like to share with you a few tips on how to position our wigs on your mannequins and fit your wigs on your clients. Our wigs are asymmetrical oftentimes. They're full around the top and they may be short around the side. So if you're not used to working with our wigs, you may not get the positioning quite right. So we wanna help you by showing you a few things. Now, these are two of our wig styles and these wigs, the, the India wig and the Thea wig, are positioned correctly on these mannequins. When you're positioning wigs a little bit off center, how it might not look quite right and you may think it's positioned correctly. So here's our beautiful Thea wig. It's one of our very full on the top tapered on the side but very asymmetrical with these asymmetrical bangs and it's easy to mistakenly position this particular wig. So for example, you don't want the wig to be turned too much to the side. This is not the right positioning for this particular wig style. Another mistake that we've seen is that the wigs are placed too far or too low on the, the mannequin head. So this is incorrect as well. You wanna make sure that there's the fullness on the top and that that asymmetrical bang is, is positioned correctly on the side. And you can refer to our wig catalogs that will have the correct positioning for each of the wigs that we sell. This is one of our older wig caps. But the best way to tell whether this wig is on correctly is to ensure that the, the wig band clips on our older caps are at the base of the neck, as you can see at the bottom. And then this is the top of the wig. Again, this is one of our older wig caps. I'll show you a newer wig cap. Here's our India wig, another asymmetrical, very, very full wig. This is meant to have a side uh, part so to speak and this is on correctly this wig would be positioned incorrectly if this was centered in this way for example or too far forward this is another slightly asymmetrical wig so we want to make sure that it's positioned correctly again you can refer to the catalog Here's how you can tell whether this wig is on correctly looking at our newer wig caps. If you turn the wig inside out, always being gentle when you're handling the wig, you'll see that our newer wig caps have these silicone grips around the, the edge of the wig cap. Those grips can be found at the base of the wig and they go up the side of the wig towards the temple. The top part of the wig, the frontal, has no grip, so you know that this is the front. Again, refer to our catalog to make sure that you're positioning the wigs correctly. We want to make sure that we give the full visual uh, for your client when they walk in and see that wig on the mannequin. And definitely when you're fitting the wig, you want to make sure that it's positioned correctly so that the client can get a full sense of the beauty of the wig and how the, the hair is supposed to fall. Remember, understanding the do's and don'ts of coily curly wig display and fitting can impact your sales, your customer perceptions, and the customer experience. Be sure to refer to the Coils to Lost catalog or this video for guidance on how to position our wigs on your clients or your mannequins. Always be careful not to disrupt the curl pattern. You don't want to create excessive frizz, so avoid the use of combs, brushes, or excessive finger manipulation. We're here to help. Send an email to info at if you need assistance.